How would you like to get an OP weapon within minutes of starting in Shrouded that will keep you safe as you learn your way around the world? When you come out of the opening tunnel, all you have with you at this point is a torch and maybe a basic weapon that you found in the first chest in there. But let's take just a torch with us. Come straight down this path. And instead of taking the bend on the curve, we're going to go up on the grass past the talking berries. Now we're going to go slowly. You could even hit C for crouch and sneak if you want. And over here is a wolf den. Don't be scared. All we're going to do is kite one away. Hello, puppy. Come over here with me. We don't want to attract the attention of his friends. So move back this way. You use control to roll in this game. So we're going to be going backwards and using control to roll away when we need to. Let him get close. Roll out of the way and hit him. Roll back. Roll. Just keep kiting him around. He gets a little stunned when you hit him. Watch your stamina. Stamina will get you every time. He pauses for a second after he barks. You can get back in another hit. Roll. Come up behind and hit him. Got it. Now if I loot the wolf, I get two bones. Sometimes I get meat and fur too. That meat is some of the best early game health food. And when I look in my, look in my inventory under crafting, magical weapons, wand, it only takes two bones to create a level one wand. Ta-da! Wands not only provide light on the end of them, but they never run out of ammunition and they let you fight moms from a bit of a distance. So the next wolf that you kill or mom that sneaks up on you, you don't have to get up close and personal if you don't want to. Happy gaming!